All right, guys, thanks for tuning into the Scan Tool Network. Now, before you say anything, I know we're not in an older Mercedes vehicle, but what I do want to do is I want to show you this tool because this tool will allow you to work on your older Mercedes vehicles. Uh, generally, these tools with the integrated screens, they will only really work on newer, modern Mercedes vehicles. This tool here, though, however, works on older models, and I'm going to show you which one of which models it'll work on. Um, before we get into it, I'm just going to uh, turn the buzzing off here because I... I absolutely hate this beeping sound every time you press a button. Um, it's available at Diagnostic World, www.diagnostic-world.com. Uh, I'll pop the link to this in the description below this video and you can uh, use that link because that'll take you to the genuine and official product, okay? Um, so yeah, so as I said, these tools normally work on modern cars, but I'm going to show you how this tool will work on older cars, older Mercedes cars. Um, Mercedes cars that don't even have the 16-pin port. Um, a lot of these Mercedes cars, the older ones in any case, they have 38-pin uh, diagnostic ports. And basically, you use this connector here. That is your 38-pin connector. And this is an official iCarsoft product. And the reason this will work is, first of all, this cable here is running into the diagnostic port of this vehicle. Um, in fact, I'll, sh I'll show you that in a second. What I'll do is I'll show you the, um, the, the vehicle coverage. So we've got some older vehicles coming at the start there. And then as we scroll through, what we get a lot of requests for is C-Class 202 and also E-Class 210. We've got 203 there as well. E class 207, E class 210, and I'm just going to scroll through the rest of them just in case there are any other earlier models there. So, some of the uh, I think the 251 might fall into that, the S140. Um, I'd need to double check the 129 falls into that bracket as well, I believe. Um, so if you do have one of those vehicles, but you, you've got the 38 pin port in the fuse box, all right, underneath the bonnet or the, the hood of the car, then what you need to do is you need to take this tool. Now this, this the, the, one, the, the illumination on this tool is gonna go off because I'm gonna unplug it from the dashboard of this vehicle. Or the, should I say the diagnostic port? Oh, excuse me, if the back of my head got in the way there. Um, so yeah, so so this tool here, this is this all runs from there, right? Now this plug here is your 16-pin port, and then you can see there it has an adapter, so that goes into there like that, and then you plug that part into the 38-pin port of your uh, older Mercedes Benz, and then when you plug that in, this tool will light up. So it's then going to allow you to start diagnosing things like the engine, uh, the ABS, the transmission, the airbags, uh, and sometimes a few other systems as well. Like it might have a, a roof fault, so it might show you the roof problems as well. Um, but it's a, it's a really good tool. It's a really refreshing tool because um, a lot of the Mercedes tools for older vehicles you have to download software onto a cumbersome old laptop with which is running an XP system uh, which are becoming sort of quite hard to find these days um, and this just offers a really really good package that just works straight from the box um, the reason this works with this connector and not the cheaper black generic connectors. So as an example, this connector here on its own is, is generally costs about 50 pounds, 55 pounds. Um, if you were to get like a cheaper generic black 38 pin connector like this, it wouldn't work with this tool. All right, I'm telling you that now because this connector here, if we open this up, it has a chip inside and the chip communicates both ways with the tool and the vehicle. So if you were to get a cheap generic OBD2, OBD1 connector, 38 pin. Uh, yeah, you'd be able to get the screen on, but it wouldn't be able to communicate with the vehicle. That's what this chip does in here. It communicates, it's a go between between the tool and the vehicle. The cheaper ones do not have this chip, so they just simply will not work. All right. Um, now, this tool itself, this package is uh, £149. So generally, if you split that cost up, it's £99 for this and it's £50 for this connector. Um, but if you click the link, it'll take you to a complete package where everything is included in the box. 
and will allow you to diagnose and uh, work on your older Mercedes Benz. So it's just uh, like I say, I'm sorry we don't have an, a new, uh, sorry, an old Mercedes Benz to show you this on, but I just uh, while I had this Mercedes here, I did want to make this video just to show anybody uh, who was maybe interested in using uh, a tool like this on their older Mercedes Benz and that it can be done. Um, also, again, uh, you know, we speak to a lot of people that have tried a lot of tools in the past, they just haven't worked. They haven't been able to find a tool and they, they generally under the assumption that they have to take it to the, the dealer or a specialist. That's not entirely the case. This tool will work. Um, it will also, you can also use this connector with like the version 2 Mercedes-Benz, the version 3. That's the, that's the version 3 tool there. Uh, but to be honest with you, this tool is geared towards newer vehicles. So it will work on older vehicles. But a lot of the functions that make up the cost of this tool won't even work on your older Mercedes Benz. So this is why this is the best seller um, for older Mercedes because it it doesn't you're not paying for functions and uh, software that you don't need. You're paying for software that is on here that does work on your vehicle. If that makes sense. Uh, okay, so as I say, link in the description. Uh, there are fakes, there are clones. Stay away from those. And uh, yeah. Click the link in the description and it'll take you direct to the genuine product. Thanks for watching and I hope it helps.